It was just after 5 p.m. on Tuesday when Farah parked her car in front of her aunt's home in Antioch with her five-year-old son Taj sleeping in the back seat. She left the car running as she ran inside to get her other child. But in those few seconds, police believe two men walked up to the car, got in, and drove off. To see your car driving down the street, you're running as fast as your legs will allow you to run and, you know, wave in your arms, bring my baby back, you can have the car. I just, I was, I felt lifeless. It would be almost an hour before the car would show up at this TA truck stop. Police say surveillance video shows two people walking away from the car and about an hour later, the child is seen walking around the parking lot. Minutes later, these paths cross when five-year-old Taj walked up to Tony Lutrick for help. And I also thank God that I'm a grandmother and a mother of many, so I knew how to talk to him. Tony stayed with Taj until police arrived to take him back to his mother. Until today, Tony and Farah have have never met. I got very teary eyed. I've, I've been wanting to meet her ever since it happened. She's our angel. We thank God for her. Um, I don't even want to think about what the outcome could have been if he didn't come in contact with Miss Tony. And neither do police who say this outcome could have turned out much different. We are very fortunate to have the outcome that we had. Uh, in a lot of cases similar to this, as you've seen around the nation, um, children are winding up found, unfortunately. Uh, deceased. Police say they just hope others learn from this mistake. Erica Schaefer, Fox 17 News.